know who I want to win? Who? Between Slim and Gib. Who? I want Slim. I want Slim to win. I want Slim okay. to put down Gib once and for all because this brother has been talking for the longest time. And now I know everyone's been saying that me and Gib are friends, this, this, that, that. Me and Gib aren't friends. We hardly ever talk. Okay, so let's get this straight. We sparred, I beat him, I destroyed him. <laughs> we aren't, he, he isn't on my level, okay? okay? So I want Slim to show the world that he's better than Gib and finally shut him up. Gib, I will, I will, trust me, bro, I will, KSI. I promise you, this kid Gib, he's so arrogant, he's so full of himself, you know what I mean? He, everybody around this whole hotel says they can't stand him because he's a piece of shit, honestly. He's just a piece of shit human. He thinks he's above everybody, but yo, you're gonna learn two lessons. Humble, ba. Okay? Thank you very much. Gib, it does seem like there are multiple people against you coming into this one. How do you feel here in fight week? This is perfect. We're just away from Doha. We got the CEO triggered because he knows I'm going to take out Misfits Best. He knows that I'm going to take him out and that will anger him because that makes me the best here. That is simple as that. So I'm excited to take this guy out. And not only is he going to see the rounds, he's going to see the speed, he's going to see the power, and he's going to see the IQ. This guy's getting knocked out. I'm so excited. Slim, what's at stake here? Obviously, the undefeated record, the belt is on the line. But for you, what does this fight mean? Yo, this fight means everything to me, man. I, put, I worked so hard this whole year, man. I've been working so hard. You know, everybody knows. Like, I, I got this opportunity because I took a fight in two weeks' notice, and I knocked the dude out. G Gib, the difference between G Gib, he got an opportunity because he's KSI's friend. He was in part of Sidemen videos. He's part of Beta Squad videos. That's why he got that. That's the difference between me and him, bro. I thought he just you know said he saying? wasn't my friend. I know, he was. You was. was. You started on his undercard, right? Right. Dan, you was in his videos, right? You and Rose Shaw videos, bro, right? Videos? That's the videos? difference between me and you. Name the videos. I grinded Name my way up. I knocked dudes it. out. Name the videos. You, you don't knock nobody out, bro. I knocked dudes out with one punch. You know what's happening? You're getting knocked out. You're getting knocked out. I'm stopping you. Yep. There is no belt on the line. You're defending your belt versus either Pappy or Kenny, and that's it. That's how they see me. So I'm taking you out. I'm taking you out. That's what it is. Such an angry little dork, I swear to God, man. But yo, I'm, I'm, I'm really gonna put the beats you. on I this kid, bro. A lot of people keep saying, I'm like, you down. online they see this I'm as like an influencer fight, but I promise y'all, this is a real fight. Yeah. Mismatch. I'm this is gonna be a real fight, bro. I really mismatch. take this boxing game You're serious. looking overtrained. You're looking serious, skinny, I'm taking But this is gonna out. be a real fight. Pose. Of build up for this grudge match. It has been a long time coming. Gib, the pressure and volume, two big X factors you bring into this. What other advantages do you believe you have over Slim? Yeah, good, good, good. He thinks it's pressure and volume, but he's going to see speed and power. He's going to see IQ. Because before, Ryan Taylor and Tom Zanetti, with no IQ and just pressure, gave him life and death. So he's going to see all of it. Well, you got knocked down by us in the room, bro. This guy doesn't even box no more. This guy doesn't even box. He Tom has Tom one win on the boxing King record. Made you tired. And the dude knocked you down. Tom Zanetti, Tom and the second King fight, made you tired. he wobbled you. You're getting stopped. I've never wobbled. I've never hit the ground. How many times you hit the ground? I'll be the first. I'll be the first to stop you. Jake Paul knocked your ass out in two you. minutes. You wait. In one round. You wait. This dude got knocked out by Jake Paul in two minutes. Two minutes, man. Goddamn. Slim, I'm curious, where do you believe Gib is weakest? What can you exploit? Man, everything. I, I, honestly, when it comes to boxing skill, I'm better than him. I, I don't see there's anything about him that's better than me, honestly. I'm better than him. I'm longer than him. I punch harder. And don't forget, I'm better looking, too. <laughs> uh -huh. Gib, where do you believe the champ is weakest? I'm going to prove that every part of his game is weak. He can't take me boxing ability, cardio, power, speed. I'm breaking him down in all departments. You're, There's a, no slow, you're a slow star. We'll see. You're a slow come. star. Tell, him it, tell your you champ get, to come you meet dropped. me. Tell your champ to come meet me. Can't bang with He's me, bro. Broken. You know you can't bang with me. You know you can't bang with me, bro. I dare you. I dare you. I dare you. I'm, I ain't moving. I'm coming for you. Square in that middle. You're going to see what's going to happen, little man. You understand? I'm coming for you. You're going to see what's going to happen, little man. I swear to God. Meet me in the middle. I might even break a rib. I might even break a rib. I'm going to break your little ribs. Black ass lead hand. You know you can't do that now? When you lead your hand out. You're pound champ. You're looking underweight. I'm going to break you. Looking underweight? It's going to be funny when I knock your ass out, man. Break him. It's going to be more funny when I knock your ass out. You can't take this right hand. I promise you that. You look overtrained. Yeah. You know what's coming. That's why you've been working this yeah, hard. Yeah, Slim coming. W. That's what's coming, baby. Bad blood flowing between you guys. Gib, how personal is this? 
you know what? I'm just here to prove that I'm the best. And that's what I'm going to do when I defeat the Misfits best. 7-0 Slim, undefeated. So then what happens when you lose? Not going to not gonna happen. What happens when you lose? Not gonna it's going to happen. Be, it's going to look real embarrassing. Not going to happen. It's going to look real embarrassing. Not going to happen. I'll be there commentating and I'll be laughing. Good, good, good. <laughs> good. Oh, it's going to be good. a fun one. Let's take it to some fan questions before we face these guys off. First up. Somebody, probably. There he is, Fred Beck. A <laughs> um, question for Amir Anderson. There's a lot of boxing, there's a lot of prospects in boxing coming up, whether they're 3 0, 4 0, 5 0. How do you want to stand out against all the other prospects into boxing? Um, my second fight, I'm doing a six rounder once again. Uh, hopefully, next year I'll be stepping up to an eight and ten rounder. Uh, these, these other prospects can't, excuse my profanity, but they can't fuck with me. Um, I'm gonna be. I'm gonna show them uh, one of the best 160s uh, in the world, and I'm gonna be world champion in the next three years.